This is Ron Mitchell with Bloodhorse.com. Today, Tuesday, September 11th, I'm at the Keeneland September Yearling Sale with Michael Hernan of Gainesway Farm. As usual, Gainesway was one of the leading consigners during yesterday's select session. And Michael, tell us a little bit about what you had yesterday and where those horses went. Uh, we had six or seven sale. We were very pleased with the prices. Um, they uh, exceeded expectations. The session was up in average and median. I thought it was a good market. Um, we sold two tappets, a Colt and a Philly, both sold well. Of course, he's a leading sire now. Um, we had a very good pin hook, son of Bernardini, who's doing especially well. And that Colt went to Shadwell for 675000 off a $350,000 purchase. Um, we also sold a very good Colt late in the sale, a distorted humor, half brother to champion Philly, my Miss Aurelia. So, to summarize, it was a good sale for Gainesway. We had no real surprises. Our horses were brought here looking excellent and well positioned in the sale, and they were fairly reserved and they sold just like we thought they would. And we've an excellent group of horses here in book two. We've commenced selling today, Tuesday. Uh, we're up on the hill in Barnes 24 and 5, and uh, nearby the sales pavilion, so conveniently located. And again, we've some excellent product to sell. The Gainesway horses have been performing well of late. We've had numerous stakes winners, some grade one winners, and we're expecting continued success from these offerings. So you're having results in the sales ring and on the racetrack. Isn't yeah. that the, uh, the perfect exacta? Well, Ron, it has to start with the racetrack. I mean, you can't over time sell horses that don't perform because the people will get burnt, and we want people to come back to the to the consignment, you know, goodwill is the probability that the old customer will return to the old store, and we certainly have that at Gainesway. We've got a tremendous following. Buyers buy from, with, from us with confidence, and the horses perform, and they're well positioned, they're well prepped, and it's, um, you know, just high quality product, and Consequently, we've had excellent sales and an excellent clearance rate in the past three years. And certainly the sales uh, sales grounds were really crowded over the weekend and yesterday. A lot of diversity among buyers. Uh, what, was, what did you guys see at your barns? Uh, we saw, you know, good demand. I think we're going to see a very good sale today, commencing in book two. Uh, very heavy uh, reviewing and, and viewings of the product and I think we're well positioned within the, the sale and with our competitors to be competitive again here in book two and uh, we've got some excellent product to blend the Colts and Phillies, excellent physical horses, they're purposely positioned into book two which focuses on the individual to a high degree and we recognize that and we bring that product purposely into book two. It's not an accident, it's planned, it's prepared for, and uh, we're having a lot of bet work here this morning, Tuesday, and I anticipate a good sale today. And certainly one of the top topics around the sales ground has been whether or not Keeneland should maintain the format of a select session. What, what is your perspective on that? Well, we, you know, we sold very well. Uh, I'm not against it. I think that's a question primarily broadly speaking, for the buyers, uh, but we did sell well in book one, and that's the front-end product, and I think uh, it's worthwhile to continue that process at least for another year and see how it plays out. Um, so we were, we were very happy with our results from last, from last evening. But from the perspective of buyers, potential buyers who've come by your uh, barn, what, what, are they, what are they telling you? Well, we're seeing probably a little deeper demand into book two. There might be a perception that book one is at a level higher than they can compete in. I don't know if that's necessarily true in reality. However, um, we did well. We will have horses for that sale if they keep it a select session next year, and that will be up to Keeneland, who, who have done a very good job promoting this sale, marketing it, excellent customer service. Uh, which is a credit to them, and this September sale has emerged as, you know, it's the real supermarket of the sale year, and um, the graduates have been outstanding, particularly this year, and based on what I see, 
coming through the Gainsway consignment, uh, there's going to be many stakes winners coming from our Chevron. Okay, great. Michael, thanks for your time and good luck through the rest of the sale.